Um, hello, people out there in the world. Um, I was just scrolling around on the uh, the uh, good old Instagram, one of my favorite channels. Um, I didn't really get too deep into it, but what's the deal with Kim Kardashian and that photo shoot she did for I more than likely for some damn magazine? But what's what? Why she look like a a, a mixture of like Diane Carroll, Diana Ross? And Beyonce. And anyone can answer that? Cause I, what, what was they going for? You, now let me. I just, I just, I just can't call it. I, I have, I have this. I, I don't even know. So back to what I was saying. Now here's the thing. I don't know if any, uh, if, if people don't understand why this can be taken and is taken not can be it is taken as what the fuck is you doing Kim you understand what I'm saying now here's the thing this is what I've noticed being black in this particular time frame and construct in which we currently live in one a lot of black people have not held up a strong stance of the way black people should be represented and you have some who do, but I mean as a collective. And so that gives room and access for those who are not black to do and say the things that they currently are doing. Like the word nigger, for an example. I don't give a fuck how you use it. Uh, er, however. I don't care. Bad. The end. It, I mean, the end. That's it. Now, once you give people the opportunity or the room to use that word or 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 um or something else or an action, for an example, as uh as an okay. Once you give other races the okay, you give first of all you give your own the okay. Then you give other races the okay. Then don't be mad at them. You know what I'm saying? I personally ain't never gave nobody no okay, and I'll tell people. I don't play like that. Don't say that around me. You know what I'm saying? Now, that, but as a collective, you got to be more together, uh, uh, the black people. You got to be more collective. You don't like the fact that people are doing blackface. You don't like that? Never like that over the years? Well, let's see. Well, you see they still doing it. They still doing it. Because, and now here's why. Because you have people who are a part of the black community, who who just took a kind of like, oh, it's whatever. Because on top of it, because we are in a society that's not run by black people, where it states like rules and regulations and acceptabilities and not, not acceptable type of actions and uh, sayings and things of that nature. So that means we're running against, we're running in a society that's not focused on us. Not necessarily. Not if it ain't sports, if it ain't music, it ain't focused on us. Needless to say, so a lot of people are not gonna take us for our word. Like, hey, we ain't too keen on that blackface shit. So you might as well get it right, get it tight, and get the fuck out of here with that. Nah, it's for an example. I have spent fr friends that are Spanish, okay, and this is what I know for a fact. Gonna get you punched in your face. You don't have a call no Spanish person, let's for instance, say for an example, they're Puerto Rican. You don't never call them nothing else besides that Puerto Rican. They're not Mexican, they're not Salvadorian, they're not, they're, they're not none of that. Wherever they're from, whatever that, that location, that's what, that's them. The end. If you want to fight, call that Dominican Adolfo Salvadorian. Bitch, you trying to, you trying to lose the teeth in your mouth. Do you understand what I'm saying? Do you see how I know that? That's because they all kind of collectively got this. Now, where all that shit stem from, I, I ain't getting into that because I personally don't know all that, but I can have my own thoughts. But you see what I'm saying? How you know that respect level. If you have any uh, Spanish friends, yeah, they don't fucking rock like that. Don't fucking do that. You know what I'm saying? You want to lose a friend quick? That's disrespect on the spot. Same thing when it comes to black people. 
I don't care who you are. I don't care if you are black. Don't do none of that blackface ass shit. And don't fucking use that word nigga. I, don't fucking put it out here in the public. And this, this, this is how you talking to each other. What? You know how many motherfucking black people done lost their goddamn lives? Over some bullshit. Shit, half the time they ain't even fucking do. No, a large majority of the time they ass ain't even fucking do. And then they got discredited and, and you can't move go, go from one state to the next even though you're supposed to be free and next thing you know you're sharecroppers and shit and you're beating this thing hung 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 after this is after motherfucking slavery anyway the point is, the, is that you go through all this shit and then it's still okay for motherfuckers to disrespect you did I miss the fucking black people memo I got the card I was born with the card when I was born, I didn't have a silver spoon in my mouth. But I had the black card in my pocket. So, did I miss the memo or something? Stop doing that. Stop allowing it within. And then, it shows people on the outside that, oh shit. They shutting shit down. Yeah, bitch. So that means we coming for you next. Once we shut it down within our own, we shutting it down with you. Don't even come over here and disrespect. So, as far as what she's doing, she tripping. But she's been given the ropes and the go-ahead to do what she's doing. What's making her think that, nah, maybe, maybe y'all shouldn't bronze me the fuck up like that. I mean, damn, you know. I mean, that shit, I mean, I'm, I know I'm beautiful and this, that, and the other, and whatever the fuck she thinks about herself. But, you know, there's nothing that made her pump her brakes. Nothing. And the motherfuckers who doled her up that way... There's nothing that made them pump their brakes neither. Because they didn't give a fuck. You understand what I'm saying? There's no way in the world I would come out of my face and say something fucked up to any my, my any one of my Italian friends. You understand what I'm saying? Never. Never. But it seems to be quite fine for other races and black people too to disrespect their own. That's when you got your minds fucked up. Totally fucked up. You'll never fucking do that shit. You never violate home base. That's why the structure is fucked up. Think about that shit for a moment. Y'all go ahead and think. Think amongst yourselves. I'll post this up so you think. Okay? You can share with me, but think. I want you to think together. Think.